Okay, I tried to do some back missions. But apparently, you can't do that with all your gear. You have to do it from scratch, which is annoying. So, I'll try to check before leaving an area if I missed anything. Okay. I wanted to catch these guys. Too bad I can't mug anyone somehow. Getting so one can't even breathe no more. Can I stand there? Oopsie. Damn, I thought I heard blood flash. Damn it. I need to pee. What was that? Ah! By the outsider's hairy ass. By the outsider's hairy ass? Is that what you said? I think no one comes here. I might want to not take that, not put them off. Oh, hello. But I wanted the bone charm. That one's close. No, no one there. Yeah, I think that's good. Um, let's just throw you over there. Have alarm bell. No, I will not trigger that. The wire tool, bullets, hat. What will that help me? Charm is here. Aha. Conservatory. What do those walls hide? Yeah, can't have you running around calling everyone.
Yeah, someone didn't want you in here. Hi. The hell? Watch for trip wires. Yeah, already shot its load. Opportunity. I have a new assignment for one of your unique talents. I'd like you to retrieve the old Rosboro prototype on display at the Royal Conservatory. Looks like you were protected by the double the finder's fee. Lucky Needle. My chance of to recover sleep dots. Huh. I'll take that. Conservatory. Okay, I think we're done here. Oh, that's nice. I missed one corrupt bone charm. Yeah! Ow. Anyone here? Show yourself. I'll have a look around. <laughs> Actually, that was kind of stupid. Let's not do that. The Royal Conservatory. What do those walls hide? Holy crap! No, 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 no. <laughs> you weren't supposed to be dead. The Royal Conservatory. What do those walls hide? Yeah, what's behind here? Oh, that's the access. Huh. What if I do it like this? Huh? What? 
Why? Why dead? Why dead? The Royal Conservatory. What do those walls hide? Yeah, I'm all full on crossbow bolts. Place this with lucky needle. These aren't worth anything. Aim high. Oh, it powers the turret. Maybe I should take out the turret. No, it's not. It powers the wall of light. Getting so one can't even breathe no more. Ah, it's blocked on the other side. Whoopsie. Whoa, okay. What the hell was that? That's how you turn off the tower. Gotta keep my mind on my duties. About 
that kiss. Oh, that kiss. Oh. Really, dude? What the hell? Didn't I pick that up? Clumsy assassin. <laughs> Brief invisibility after choking or assassinating an enemy. I'm louder and more visible when leaning. No. How the hell did I miss that? Aren't there any more things I can burn? Like with a whale tank oil. Whale oil tank. Now when I hold it up, I can't do anything. Was a man from old his doctor was as wee as a minnow. His doctor... Oh my. Is that my breath I'm smelling? Maybe my teeth are due for their monthly cleaning. Yeah. Maybe you should do it more than monthly. Burning whale oil. Wolfhounds. Yep, I guess I need to go get the wolfhounds. Yeah, it's either wolfhounds or raid up. Really, there's a bone charm nearby. There's a lot. Nothing climbable? Okay, let's try the wolfhound way.
The conservatory. I wanted to visit this place with Wyman. Is that a person? I think it is a person sitting down. I think the best way is to knock these suckers out. No good. Shouldn't be noticing me. The conservatory. I wanted to visit this place with Wyman. It's not enough. to expose locked on the inside Dear Parmelia, Delilah wears the outsider's mark, and some of what she can do flows down to us. Oh shit. Wicked witches. <sighs> Why didn't I pick that up? The conservatory. I wanted to visit this place with Wyman. They don't count. Gravehound skull. Oh. a body. Breaking and entering job. Use cliffside outside office window to get over fence. Drop down and enter basement through delivery door. Special display is on second floor. Enter through security room. Grab Roseboro prototype. Don't forget to disable the alarm. Easy money. <coughs> Stinging bolts.
What the hell am I missing here? Hello. Unsteady hand. <clears throat> Enemies miss with fire projectiles more often. Enemies shouldn't see me. <clears throat> A reflection on my journey to the Dendysian continent. Archive key. Territory closure extended. Yeah. What's over here? Giant turtle. I think it is. Oh, the woman. They are just jealous. If I want to dance, then I can twirl around all I want. Just try and stop me. Try not to kill witches too. Found dead. Ashworth's journal might tell me more about why Delilah can't be killed. Premonition, no need. No need. Doppelganger. That's an interesting way to go. Mesmerize. Yeah, I can't take over rats, that's Corvo's thing.
Enhancements. Crafting bone charms. I don't know, I don't think I need to craft bone charms. I think I'm gonna go the top again the whole domino. Top again will confuse the music as it fades away. Deadly shade. Oh no. Transportation. Transposition. Swap. The void leading me to the Duke, who heard those same whispers. Together we work to bring Delilah back into the world, changing the Empire from the home of... Wait, 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 wait. Start again. After Delilah fell to the assassin Dowd, her magic was lost, and the coven scattered. I made a new life in Karnaka. Then I heard her whispering from the void, leading me to the Duke, who heard those same whispers. Together we work to bring Delilah back into the world, changing the Empire from the home of Aramis Stilton three years ago. Across the aisle, all of us who'd been with her at Brigmore and before, we felt the magic return. Others joined. New faces, new blood. Now, Delilah... She holds Dunwall, and we've turned to corrupting the oracular order. The overseers take guidance from their prophetic sisters, and soon we'll influence their dreams and visions. Oh shit. Because she came back on the void doesn't mean she can't be killed. I need something flammable. Um, let's save. Next time I run into enemies, I'll try doing it the mesmerized way. Oh, was, there, was there Ember in this one? Because I think this is flammable. Unconscious switch. Blood Ember. Blood Ember. Don't know what the hell that is. Built whale oil. That's not a thing. There is blood and burn there. Thank you. Never use the elevator. While sneaking around. Basement. Main hall, mezzanine, upper level. We're in the basement. We are in the basement. Yeah, elevator, where I am. Archive, where I was. There's the lobby. Delivery entrance, where I came in. Okay, so I'm taking this to the first floor, which will leave me here. That's stairs and lobby. Okay, I'm good with that. By the way, I have this. Right? Yeah. Whoa, 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 where the hell did that come from? The 
the skulls. Three of them? Maybe I should take the elevator. All the way to the top. Third floor. All changes should be approved by architect. Goddamn witches. Are you freaking kidding me? They're sitting on the chandelier. Okay, let's try this. Sorry, I had to stop you. In those messages, was money. Okay. 
really shouldn't be on a lot. There's three of them. Coming to the place where they hit, or they coming to the place where they shot from? Portrait. What would you and father advise if you were both here? Sometimes I dream we're all together again. We have this. Push out into the harsh world. You are alone, but for a few allies. Type fighter. That's the office. Forgive me. No, my dear, it's a loss, but I doubt he had anything more to give us. Sokolov was taken away as well. Two of them. Who would want that ancient fool? Never mind. How goes the communion? I am hungry to whisper into the ears of the oracular sisters. My influence grows. Last night, I walked through a dream with one of them and we drank from a fountain in the town where she was born. The Vice Overseer Burns' suspicions were right. No, he continued to tinker with the lenses. Thicker, thinner, more opaque. It was tiresome to watch. I still had the old lenses and cast off parts piled in my workshop, but Jendash finished some time ago. The rest is up to me, learning to use the machine. A tricky thing, touching the void through such a device. Blood and biscuits. I look forward to using it myself once you're ready. Will you visit soon? Perhaps. Dunwall Tower is mostly in hand. The High Overseer won't be a problem anymore. And there's the matter of my own project. I grow more excited with each brushstroke. When I come to Karnaka, we'll drink an ocean of good wine and stay tight as a boiled owl. I look forward to it. For now, I need your eyes on the Duke. At least until we have the sisters under control. There's no one else I trust. I'll reach out to you again on the morrow. Farewell. Goodbye, Delilah, my emperor. Interesting. I can't go in through here and my camera is oversaturated. Uh, what can I do about that? Filters? Filters? Uh, effect filter? Color grading? Blue lift. Whoa. Let's turn down the blue a little bit. That seems like a more appropriate color. Let's try that. Yeah, I have to go from above. There's a bone charm over there. There's a rune over there. 
That's beyond the wall. This is broken. I can go in through here. But... There we go. There we go. The Silver Spike, a genius inventor, can barely recall his own name. Kirin Jindash loses his smart in a bold experiment gone wrong. We know him as the grand inventor, the genius of our time, but that was before his latest experiment went somehow wrong, leaving the man a blubbering shell of his former self. Scandalous but true. Servants are gleefully coming forward with stories of the once great inventor now barely able to navigate from room to room. One woman claims that Jindosh is now unable to determine which way to turn a simple bolt. Everyone knows it's sidey tidy, she said. Another wondered openly whether Jindosh may have been using his pupil's ideas all along, faking his genius to gain reputation. Allegedly, a cruel employer, sadistic in his dismissal of his staff's basic needs, there is one curious turn in the story. Those closest to the inventor claim that he is now gentle as a lamb. <laughs> okay. What the hell? Discarded lenses, new mission item. A collection of discarded lenses bearing Kirin Jindosh's characteristic craftsmanship, etched with occult markings. The Astounding Clockwork Soldiers. Vienna Ashworth's note. The reason the lenses Jindash and I devised for the oculum were horribly flawed. Rather than focusing the energies of the void, the faulty lenses scattered them. My head was filled with noise and the spiritual channel linking me to the Lila's magic was nearly extinguished. I would not cease my efforts until our coven controlled the sisters of the oracular order. But I know now that I proceed at grave danger, grave risk. The old lenses could have been my ruin. They are stored in my workshop for now, but must be destroyed. If I can sabotage Ashworth's communion device, she'll be powerless. Yes. Replacing the lenses on the Aklim could sever Brianna's Ashworth's link to Delilah, eliminating Ashworth as a threat. Found her, install discarded lenses. Owler dust. That's a hand. Wait, isn't there a way down from here? Can't just go yet. Oh, there's the way down. I don't want to steal all her stuff before I go.
That looks important. Aha, there she is. Why the woman you call Megan has been stalking up. You have no idea. I will stop. Okay. Wait, which is aren't affected by sleep dots? Broken whalebone sword. A corpse? What in the world? What are you talking about? Hmm. What? Here? Hello, invisible thread. Our reach enters you invisible during movement. Oh, yes. something black bone charm notes I set out to craft a new bone charm and I hope to have it blacken in keeping with those greater power it will complement the one I've carried since finding it within a mausoleum in Alba though it's rare to meet others touched by the void summoners beware for as long as I carry that bone charm their rats and vermin will turn against them and the new charm if it works will shield me against assassins I'm still working on my protective charm. I've taken the TV and grey bone recipe and altered it using much more burdock root. Instructions were vague and the safeguards it offers are weak. Neither chamomile nor nestortians added to the mix give me the right effects, though they perfume the air quite nicely. I feel well protected from unpleasant smells, but not much else. I finally got it. Hellebore, of course. Fermented and reduced over a flow flame. It's rare to achieve this effect where the bone charm turns the darkest black. As I wanted, I warded, I warded against the first bullet or bolt from an assassin's weapon. The initial shot that would fell me will instead change to blood flies in an instant. Ah. Brianna carries two bone charms. One protects her from summoned entities, turning them against her summoner. The other protects her from fire, first bolt or bullet coming from an assassin's weapon. Can I take them? For that, I need to sneak up to her. She's growing plants in the bathtub. Okay, so I need to kill her mutts. Without her noticing. And then distracting her. <coughs> Let's try it like this. Bang. Bang. <laughs> Shit. One shot is not enough. In the 
Ow. Ow, what the hell? Okay, so it is possible to knock her out. Just take some time. Rather rude to die here, whoever you were. Your bullets become blood flies. Aha! Your first shot will never reach me. Someone thought they could shoot me without introducing. Okay, okay. Now I get it. It seems rather rude to die here, whoever you were. Got it. You can't shoot her. My files burn within Brianna's marrow. What's that? What in the world? Ah, damn it. Watch the health. Watch the health. Hmm. It seems rather rude to die here, whoever you were. God damn it. A corpse? What in the world? I saved. Hmm. It seems rather rude to die here, whoever you were. Okay. Did what I needed to do. Done straightening up. Mr. Spriana, like you asked, I stole your audiograph recordings in the archive down there in the basement and I tied it up around the oculum. Just as you asked, some of the others were talking about the old lenses you took out of the oculum device after the accident, saying they were going to bury them lenses forever at the bottom of the ocean. Well, that didn't sound right to me, so I just stole them in the effigies workshop in case you'd find them some use. All my other chores are done, so I'll go prepare your leche salty. I'm grateful for the second chance you've given me. I'm sure over time I'll feel Delilah's presence and learn the magic, like my coven sisters. Please don't cast me out. I'll make you and Empress Delilah proud, I promise. Because of you, I can fix everything. Delilah, when we can't talk... I write, there are things only you will understand. Daily, I feel my connection to the Void growing, and through me, me, your power calls out to those who would join our coven. New faces, new voices. Our bond is stronger than it was at Brigmore, yet you feel so far away. If, you were t if we were together, I could say more. It is as far as I can see beyond the air into another time or place. You have parted a curtain I never knew was there. Oh, Delilah, strange and beautiful whispers are carried on the breeze. I'm forever grateful of being your instrument. Bone charm, fickle beast and bloodfly something.
blood fly alchemy. An enemy initial rage attack is transformed into blood flies. White wolfhounds fight on your side. I don't want them to kill anything. I'll take this. Actually, I shouldn't even need this. No, nothing interesting here. Okay, time to fix the oraculum. Flicker. Yeah, I can't do that until I like, dealt with all of them. Where are they? Yeah, there they are. Um, it was six, three. Don't go too far away. Where's the third one? die. I think the third one came after me. Okay. Sit here. And you sit there. And I think that's everything. Right? I see two more. The hell? Okay. So this could be tampered with. Oracular order divided. A representative from the Sister of the Oracular Order in Sarconus paid a surprise visit this week to officials at the Grand Palace, delivering a message that called into doubt the Order's formerly held position on the illegitimacy of our new Empress, Delilah Caldwin. It seems that there is intense disagreement between the sects of the secretive organization. While not a full reversal, the visit to the Grand Palace prompted the following statement from Duke Luca Abel. It pleases me that the Sisters of the Oracular Order have come close to endorsing our beloved Empress, Delilah Caldwin. A recent and valiant coup is an attempt at restoring just rule to the Empire, and I advise the Oracular Order and the ever stubborn Abbey of the Everyman to immediately embrace Delilah as Empress, accepting her wisdom and authority. We thank the Oracular Sisters for delivering this vision, and we call for a day of celebration. Meanwhile, Vice Overseer Liam Byrne, talking on, speaking on behalf of the Abbey of the Everyman, advises restraint, saying that the latest missives from the Oracular Order are still being interpreted and debated. Ashworth could be cut off from the void entirely. No more witchcraft. Don't die. She's dead. Ah.
Oh, there's the other one. So this could be tampered with. Ashworth could be cut off from the void entirely. No more witchcraft. Yay. I don't like the witchcraft. Witches, you're not gonna kill them. Just don't turn yourself. Okay, I think that's everything. Online. Is that a test facility for a wall of light? Look at technology in the new age. like something's up. Let's fix this thing. Now to activate it and sever Ashworth's connection to the void. Oculum focal point. I need to bring her here? Okay.
will I do now? Eliminated. Ruined. The feeling. The things I could do. The touch of the void. The Lila. It was everything I had. Leave me be. A corpse? What in the world? Do you know how long I've served, Delilah? Al? Al? Yeah, just stay there. I want to run a quick check upstairs in case I missed anything. Like that. Excellent, nice. That's just a book. All the witches are gone. That is a blood fly infestation over there. I can see the ember. So, better bring that thing. Anything else flammable I can use? Oh. Bone charm. Void armor. When you take damage, a significant portion is instead subtracted from mana. Sure. Curse written and researched by Tavisa Alba. Huh. Above the elevator. Who sleeps here? Bone charm at 45. Bone charm at 75. Balloon at 75. Into the harsh world. You are alone, but for 
for a few hours. Get in. The lamp, the, the elevator, Ashworth's office. Nothing on the second floor. What is this? What is this? Okay. Bone Charm 29, Ruin of 31. We need to get down to the f next floor. This one is on this floor. There has to be more flammable things, come on. Give me the flammables. Don't eat anyone. Last thing I need. Whoa. This doesn't look good. There we go. Banana. Oh 
natural philosophers by Kenneth Obinshaw. There is always a cure. The question is, what are you willing to sacrifice to have it? Unfinished letter to Abigail. This is gonna catch on fire someday. No, not good enough. Um, that looks like a giant folk. Nothing here is flammable enough. Just this bone child. Something, anything. All the gin over the sugar and stir. Add the ice and grate nutmeg over the top. Huh. Nothing else I can use that's flammable. Spencer. Spencer. Wind locked salt contents more easily. Never happened to me. else. Okay, let's see if I missed any special actions. Dishonored to conservatory secrets. Bone charm, bone charm and painting, outside of sign, shine, painting, bone charm, bone charm rune, safe. I think I did everything in that case. Yeah, picked up everything my heart could pick up. 
What about special actions? Show negotiations. Negotiate a better price for the Rosenboro prototype found in Brianna's office. You have to find a note that's located in the desk in the abandoned flat. Parley with Delilah. You have to eliminate Brianna first. I found the thing about the Rosenboro prototype. Witch no more, disjoint Brianna from the void, bloodless solution, the black market heist. And find out what Burn knows. I think I did all of that, so let's talk to Delilah. As if you could ever hide your face from me, Emily. Little Black Sparrow, free from your cage at last. It's done. Brianna Ashworth is no longer a witch. You villain! You don't even know what you've done! A great bloom wilts and fades from the world. Delilah, I will take apart everything you've built until I have what's mine. Oh, Brianna. I don't believe we will speak again. I'm not Brianna. The thought of seeing you reduced to such a pale, sad thing. It's too much to bear. I hate you for this, child. Well, I hate you first. I'm not only going to restore things to the way they were. I'm going to make them better. Okay. Wait, what about the security key? Security room key. Roseboro prototype. Yeah, that's what I need. The security room can be viewed in the main room. You must enter it from the other side. If the alarm is not deactivated, the security mechanism is locked down the room. This allows a nearby witch. I, I disabled all of them. Rat tunnel opening above the locked door. That guard near the alarm could open and has the key. Yeah, they want it. Why didn't I see that? Seriously? Still alarmed. Oh, there we go, the security room key. go. What the hell is this thing? An early mechanical prototype of Bayesmund Rosborough that could be used to upgrade non-chemical firing mechanisms. Huh. The 
problem is I knocked that guy out. Shit. Custodian? And total. And they're all asleep. That's a blocked door. The guards here should still be alive. But the tower's out. Who's there? No, no, nothing's there. Don't worry about it. Let's try for a distraction. What? Dancing hagfish on the wall. Damn it. I need to pee. Twelve weeks have I been at sea. There are five of them. There's no real point in actually taking them out. Check that area out. No, I'm sure. I'll find you, you know. Hello? Anybody? 
don't make me search the whole place. I don't come have time on. That. Victor, I'm going to have a fair fight. I'll find you. What's the fun in the fair fight? Yeah, I can't talk to him now. Crap. I should use more mines. So it's done. Ashworth won't be a problem anymore. Good. But Emily, there's something else. What? Back when I lived in Dunwall, I did things that I'm not proud of. Isn't that a requirement for citizenship? <laughs> what I've got to say is not a joke. I knew Delilah and Ashworth. Bought into their bullshit. Which led me down a bad road. To be honest, before all this, I thought Delilah dead. Yeah, me too. I don't want to get into it right now. But I felt like you should know. There are things I regret. All right, Megan. Thank you for opening up. If only a little. I'm starting to feel like you deserve it. Are you ready to leave now? Yeah, I guess I am. Yes, let's go. Take me back to the Dreadful Whale. Another step toward the Duke of Sirkonos and Delilah. Not long now. Okay. I was detected, but no one died. So, not great on stealth, but still non lethal. Found almost everything. I keep missing the blueprints. Parley with Delilah, which no more black market heist and spying overseers. Let's go down and talk discuss your next steps before taking the skiff to the Dust District. For several years, Delilah's been here, getting stronger turning people against me. Why didn't I see it coming? What was I doing during that time? Pretending to listen at court, ruling through an army of bureaucrats, waiting for the next chance to get free of Dunwall Tower. Well, now I'm free. If only I could go back. Aramis Stilton was once an ally of the Duke. The owner of Karnaka's mines, Stilton lives in a fortified bunker at the heart of the Dust District. No one's seen him for years, since around the time Delilah started making her moves. But whether Stilton's alive or dead, his home holds the key to Delilah's immortality. Can he help? Can he be an ally? Along. Hmm. 
Alexandra left. She left me a formula. My mind is finally clearing. Now I can return to my work here, helping those who need it the most. And what can I say about what you've done for me? Saved me from madness and worse, from giving in to a life of sadistic brutality. How could I ever repay you for that? Given who you are and what you're in Karnaka to do, I can only say good luck. The city, the country, the empire, everyone is counting on you. I'll send something special for you by way of courier. I hope it helps. Okay. Making me take care of myself. Listen to me talking to myself like the old man I am. Is that a shark or a tuna? I gotta try this. Brianna Ashworth. What? <laughs> I threw a fish head at him and he died. Thank you for that. My mind is fine. And let's do this. What am I worried about making me take care of myself? Listen to me talking to myself like the old loon I am. The hell? Making it out in this silver spike. How long? Silver seals. The dust district. Hmm. I've read about the winds coming through the cleft in Shindere Peak. How the city uses it for windmills and mining operations. I never expected to feel so tired. I came to Karnaka for the food. But is to overlook. Here. Now this. Nice map. Yeah, but this is the mining distance. That's where we're headed. Aramis Stilton's home looks more like a bunker than a mansion. Stilton's home? What happened there uh, three years ago? Leanna Ashworth. With Ashworth eliminated, that should hamper Delilah's plans. What I wouldn't give for one more expedition. Delilah. My aunt, if that's really true. She has a twisted way of looking at the world. Emily, it's true, I don't think it would mechanical devices much anymore, but I'm not so old as to be useless just yet. Behold, I have fashioned a little contrivance for you. Using only parts scavenged from this wretched vessel. Yes, alright, a few bits were currently in use, but I assure you none were involving in keeping us afloat. Say nothing to Megan, as her disposition needs no further souring. In any case, may this device serve you well. I have plenty of those. I actually left like three of them behind in the last mission. Oh, again, neglected channel. Okay, talk to me. I need to know why Delilah can't be killed. Everything we've learned implies that something strange happened at Aramis Stilton's home three years ago, but then he disappeared. Stilton lived in a bunker kept secure by a fancy lock made by Jindosh. Maybe inside you'll learn more about how to stop Delilah. But I have to get there first. Through a ruin created by the Duke, where my father grew up. Megan had an intriguing idea. Paolo is leader of the Howlers. He wants Vice Overseer Byrne killed. And of course, Byrne wants Paolo dead too. Both groups will attack you on sight, but walk in with the corpse of their chief enemy, and they'll treat you like family. You think they'll help me get into Aramis Stilton's home? I'm pretty sure that will work. Seeing this place, and these people, I can feel my perspective changing. How will I be different after this? I'm not killing anyone. 
Maybe I'll bring Paolo's unconscious body to the overseer. Paolo's not that old, but there's so much living written into the lines of his face. The vice overseer for Karnaka, Liam Byrne. That's it. Oh, you're taking me? Yeah, let's go. Ready. We'll take Megan's skiff closer. The Dust District. You must travel through the Dust District to Aramis Tilton's manor, which contains more of Delilah's secrets. Vice Overseer Byrne and his religious followers are at war. With Paolo, leader of the Howler Gang, either Byrne or Paolo will aid you for a favor. The Howler Gang uses customized pyrotechnic crossbow bolts to stun and intimidate enemies. Howler bolts. Who was the man I'm after? Aramis Stilton? Okay, it's saved. So I'm gonna do this next time. Thank you very much for watching. See you next time. Stay good. Have fun.